And guess what, guys? It's our next temple. Arbiter's Ground. That's right, Arbiter's Ground. You can get off here if you want. I, I didn't want to dash, dude. Oh my god. Oh, thank god. Get me off of that thing. Get me off this bird. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, so let's climb up the stairs. Since there are stairs there. Hey, it's a Poe. Cool. Let's get him. I wasn't even thinking, like, yeah, it's like... <laughs> there we go! Pull it out, baby! I like it when I'm stepping into my balls. Get the post hole. Oh, let's turn that off. Okay. Yeah, because see, now you're going to be using your combination of your human and your wolf form throughout this temple. So, that'll be interesting. I think this is really the only temple that utilizes it, so it's kind of sad, but... You know, it's a fun temple. I, I would say it's the second hardest in this game, so, so we're definitely up for a little bit of a challenge here. I don't know, I mean, call me crazy, but I think this is harder than Snow Peak. So, I don't know. Maybe it's just because of the layout. I mean, Snow Peak is easy because it's so symmetrical. Like, I have no problem finding my way around there. But this place, just, wow. Ugh. So you come in here and you got all these rooms with all this sand flowing all over the place. Sand. Not a big fan of sand, I'll be honest, viewers. Not a big fan. Man, do we have to do this all now before we finish the recording? I was going to make kind of a quick recording session here, and now I'm starting at Temple. Well, I guess too bad now. This is the Arbiter's Grounds. Welcome to it. Better get used to it. So first things first, we're going to turn into a wolf. Because wolf is not nearly as affected by... You know what? What the hell am I doing? You're such an idiot, dude. There's nowhere you can go from here. You need to use the claw shot to actually get over these uh, sand pits here. So um, now we got to do some fancy footwork here. Try to get across here like this. And some of these platforms aren't so stable, so you got to watch out. Hey, let's hook shot the Triforce. Yeah, good idea. Well, this here you can actually kind of just go across it, but you might sink. So, oh, 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 can we make it? Oh, we just barely made that. I thought I was dead. Okay, now apparently there's a gate here that we can't really get through. So what we're going to do is go over here, and we're going to claw shot in the way like it's pointing at me. Hey, what are you doing? You're dead, man. You're trying to push it with your finger? You're dead. All right. So grab your claw shot, like I was saying before. Grab this handle here so you don't have to go out in the sand to get it. And then just pull it. Ugh. Good job, Link. That's the man. That's my man. Ow. I'm trying to avoid the sand here. Ugh. Yeah. You can sink pretty far in there before... What the hell? Well, as long as I'm here, I might as well uh, refill my lantern, huh? Scoop. Alright, there you go. Is this okay, Mommy? Uh... Or is this okay, Daddy? I don't know. Jeez. Oh, hey. Oh, it's an unstable platform. Get away. What do we got? This better be a key, because I'm telling you. Okay, yeah, it's a small key. Yay. Ooh, 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 bugs, 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 bugs. Check this out. This is so cool. Okay, see how they're coming for me? Wait a minute. They don't know how to climb up a wall? Well, they must have got buried in the sand. There's two right there. I don't know. Anyway. <laughs> yeah, you know what I said before, you better not have a fear of bugs when you're going through this temple. And, you know, this is the reason why. Or those bugs are part of the reason why. So, oh my god. Yeah, so you want to keep your lantern oil fairly full here. I think I have an extra bottle of it, so. I think you're almost better off not locking on here. And just using spin attacks or... You know, or bomb arrows, maybe? I don't know. But spin attack pretty much wipes them out. Yeah. And they drop hearts, thank goodness. For such a small enemy, you wouldn't think they would. You're not very forgiving with that these days. Okay, well, I guess there wasn't much in there. Wait, what? That's not a door? Oh. Yeah, I guess I need to kill all the Stalfos. Or Stalfos, mini Stalfos, whatever they are. <laughs> Oh, come on, dude. Don't brain fart on me now. What the hell am I doing in this room? 
Oh well, let's, I'll just, oh dude, come on, oh my god, oh my god. Light the torches. Jeez. <laughs> Holy crap, you're stupid. Okay, let's go through the door. Man, I don't know if I'm gonna cut that or not, jeez. Okay, so, guess what? This looks familiar. Gee, I wonder what's gonna happen here. Four torches? Let me guess. Okay. Well, if you don't know what this is a throwback to, I'm not even gonna bother to say it because it ain't worth saying. Well, it is worth saying because it's cool, but it ain't worth saying for informative purposes. Bam! And that door. That's, something about that door is kinda cool. Oh man, you guys. You can't do this to me right now. Oh, your three friends abandoned you and left you to fight me all by yourself. Now, the thing that's different about these pose here is that you can't just attack them any old time. You gotta wait till they're actually attacking you. And you'll know when they're about to because they'll change color like so. Like, just jump on them and give them the one two. And then do the same thing. Like, you don't even have to dodge. You just, if you're fast enough, just hit them right away. And then do like before and just take your soul out. I like it when I'm sniffing it out of my balls. Post soul number two. Well, so much for that. I guess we got one back already. That was easy. Huh. Now, the first part of this temple, it can be complicated, but it's not so bad because the game basically tells you exactly where to go. So, I don't... So, that's not so bad. Uh, well, first things first. Wait, wait, wait. Don't do that yet. We need to catch the scent here. That's alright. Forget the scent of Ilya. For, well, I don't really want to forget the scent of Ilya, but okay. I, mean, I don't think I'd... You know, the scent of a pose is probably not more pleasant than the scent of Ilya. But I'm just guessing there, you know. So anyway, you got the front... Wait, what, what the hell? Am I looking at this backwards? Yeah, I guess I am. Okay, so this is the front door where we're trying to get. Now, to the left and right of it, there's a couple of treasure chests which we want to go ahead and get now, because you can. You can get these now. Don't do what I did in my practice run and wait till you're halfway through the temple and then get them. Because one of them is a piece of heart, and this collects five pieces and forms a new heart container! Yeah! That's one of our two heart containers in the temple. The other one is... Uh, somewhere else. I think you have to use the item to get to it. Oh, for crying out loud, you can make that. Jeez. Oh, can I? Oh, crap. I don't think I can. <sighs> oh, 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 sorry, Link. Oh, <laughs> he sticks his claw shot up in the air, like, for one last, you know, desperate attempt. Just in case somebody might be there to help him. Oh, so much for that. I guess you're supposed to claw shot over instead of using the... Shit. No, 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 no. Get... Well, I was looking for a target and I just saw you guys. What the fuck? Wait a minute. The platforms respawn? That other one didn't respawn. No, no, no. I'm lo oh, I wasn't locking on. Maybe I can't stay locked on. I don't know. Anyway, there's another treasure chest over here. We should really get this right now while we still can. Which is... The dungeon map! Press right to view the map. You know how it goes. So, yes. Would you guys quit? Oh, man. I don't know what's wrong with you today. Freaking bubbles, whatever you are. Bubble, bubble, bubbles. Okay, so this is where your wolf senses come in handy. Because when you use your senses, you can see that there's three trails going off, which will lead to the other three pose. Now, when you're looking at the door, and this is only on the GameCube version, this is the one that I always like to do first. Uh, to the right, there's one going through the door here. There's also one going in the dirt here. So we want to check this out first, because this leads to a switch, which you can pull as a wolf. Just about anything that you can do as a human, you can also do as a wolf, like pulling switches and shit. So it's not too bad. Oh, Machen's getting really close to the screen over there. I have to give him some... Yeah, check this out. When you open a door as a wolf, it opens it for you. <laughs> Pretty cool. Now this room always bugs me. I've never remember exactly. Okay, I know there's a switch here that you can turn the thing, but there's also like a hole in the ceiling over here that you can, I don't know, that you can't do much about right now. I don't think I'm supposed to go this way first, but... Oh man, push that thing, Link. Hope it doesn't hurt your back too much, because it looks like it would. Yeah, we changed something up there. Let's push it again. Dude. 
Wait, oh, that's right, you can only push it one. Shit, that sucks. Oh, no, I'm being chased by a redead, y'all. Uh, yeah. That's a problem. That's a big problem. <laughs> Ow! Holy crap, I'm on me. Let me turn back into a human here. So there's a number of different ways you can take care of this. One of them is the Immortal Thrall. Which he might stop you in the middle of it. Well, that sucks. That really sucks, man. Let me try that again. No. Maybe that's not the best idea, then. Okay, fine. You want to be that way about it. Yeah, you could just do this right here, kind of like you did with Iron Knuckles in Ocarina of Time. You get some distance from him, that way he doesn't... Well, I don't know. Good lord, dude, how much range have you got on that sword? Who do you think you are, Cloud? 